Asian, Asian country in Asia and the Pacific, like and uh, Nepal and India, is affected by the transgender community. It's, it's a it's a hitra community for uh, like a third gender of the uh, men and women. But in Myanmar, there is a the clinical three seven seven is the exit, and so. Yeah, session 377, it's called the Pinnacle 377. It's the so there's uh, the, uh, transgender and the same sex marriage is not legally recognized in our country. And also, the, there is not illegal to be have a, to have a sex with a, a man who have sex with men. So they cannot disclose, they don't want to disclose their uh, life and their sexual orientation and gender identity. So, but we are making some advocacy and community awareness raising campaign like uh, in addition to against homophobia and transphobia, so uh, there will be um, there is is much changing in community, so they can easily flexible to the uh, transgender like uh, they are the not they are not only the HIV carrier, so but we need to more, we need to make more uh, stay uh, we need to make more than the, in our future uh, rather than the now. No. Or the, the, the prevalence of HIV epidemic is still higher in, in now, so we should, we should have to make more prevention and the treatment program to, to have a more effective community to the PR approach. Uh, Myanmar is also the country who is adopted the uh, SDG in uh, September 2015. So, but actually, basically, we have a meeting at, uh, to orient it and what, uh, to review the SDG, what is uh, uh, expressing in the SDG. And I think it's around November 2050, there's a meeting uh, to, to, to address the SDG. But uh, after that, there is no specific activity or no specific program to implement or to approach the SDG in Myanmar. So we have to make, uh, make more advocacy to rule out the SDG in, uh, in practically. Yes, um, there is some kind of some kinds of discrimination and stigma in wages and um, uh, in wages and salary income. I mean income, uh, but um, it's because of, uh, the the people are mostly uh, uh, low legal literacy and also the low and non educated. They are the poor, so they have to they have to make the job with the um, low amount of the income uh, wages. Yeah. Um, I believe that everything uh, what we want to set, uh, what we want to develop in the future is should be set with the education. You know, because education is the foundation of the all, all, the, all kinds of development programs. So we have to make uh, effort and you know, we have to make uh, uh, make much, much more uh, clear set of the education program. So it, it can be the, the next step of the it can be the entry point of the next step.